Would you say that you're a responsible fur parent? Hi, it's Nancy Soleri. Now, everyone who knows, I love my fur babies. Now, back in the day, there was Lionel Richie, my Jack Russell Terrier, rest in peace, buddy. And today, I have my Chihuahua Charlie. He's a 10 pounder, but he really rules the roost. <laughs> and then I've got my big hearted Labrador guide dog Frost. And I know down the line, I will have more fur babies because I love them. But I do know it comes with responsibility. And truly, they are my babies. And I think about all the time, what brings them joy? Yes, the bones, the treats, the, the kisses, the snuggles, right? And we have to make sure that we have time for that because a dog that's just at home by itself, maybe locked in a room, they really do feel sad. They feel lonely. They may not feel as though you love them. There is nothing more exciting for me than seeing their jaws drop and they smile and their, their tails go crazy. And, and that to me knows that I'm in the right lane, that I'm being a good fur mom. Now, we also have to think about outside the home, right? Do you have enough poop bags, right? We all see the poop on the ground. Somebody didn't have a poop bag. We're gonna assume that they just didn't have one and it was an off moment. But there are some serial offenders that don't pick up poop and you know, do things like having their dog off the leash when it should be on a leash to protect other people and other dogs. So you always wanna think about others when you're out and about, are you, you know, doing the right thing, not just by your dog, but also by other owners and other people that may be nervous around dogs, even though your pooch is probably very loving and loyal. And we wanna make sure that, just like how I mentioned Lionel Richie, my Jack Russell passed away, it's important that we always keep those dogs and cats and all pets really that, have, that we've loved over the years and have given us joy near and dear to our hearts. I like to think that Lionel is with me every day. I still have pictures of him in my home. And uh, he truly, he was a part of the beginning of my living full out journey and, and creating my company, the radio show and beyond. So he is with me no matter what. But we wanna make sure that you click on the video in the description, because if you lost a little love bug along the way, it will bring you joy. And we wanna take today to remember them. We also want to make sure that you subscribe and click that bell because we want to make sure that we keep you updated on videos that give you access to being a better fur parent or make you laugh when we see animals doing fun things or just that kind of feel good video that makes you just want to snuggle up with your dog or cat or be on on a couch and just, you know, enjoy being with each other. So most of all, for all of you out there that are responsible dog owners, you know, kudos to you, proud of you, keep loving big, lots of kisses, lots of licks and hugs and panting. That's what it's all about. Here's to all of you living full out. Thank you for watching our YouTube channel. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you'd like to see other inspirational videos. Make sure to ring that bell. Also connect with us on other social media sites and comment back if you'd like to share what type of videos you want us to create. Here's to you living your life full out.